south end, flick it on from Woodrow, but uh, safely into the arms of Lenny Pidgeley. And the ball gets thrown out to uh, Robbie Wilmot. Wilmot, lovely ball down the line, ready for Washington. Washington, first time cross into the box. Billy Jones goes away to take County's third corner of the half. Left footed in from Jones, got another good corner, finds Mitchell, shot blocked by Bentley on the line. Comes back out again to Minchell, plays it low in this time, but uh, Southend will bring it away. Good play, finds Naylor. Naylor playing it up to Zabrowski. Plays it away to this near side to Wilmot. Comes down the left wing, Wilmot. Looks up, plays it forward, finds Zabrowski. And then it'll go off the boot of the Southend player. Uh, doesn't go out of play though, and Wilmot picks it up, gets it to the byline, crosses in left footed. Finds Washington, who's being pushed all over the place, but the referee says uh, that uh, Washington committed the foul. First, looks up, crosses low right-footed, but it's headed away by Ishmael Yakubu. Only up as far as Robbie Wilmot. Robbie Wilmot plays the ball up over the top. Washington goes on the chase. Bentley comes out, and Washington has scored! Oh, Washington and Robbie Wilmot. What a decisive pass that was. But uh, the defensive frailties at centre back shown by Southend. They had to make a change because of suspension. And it's Robbie Wilmot's pass to Connor Washington, who signed that new contract this week that puts County 1 0 up. The ball is with Coker on the far side. But Jackson gets a foot, he does well, and gets it to Zabrowski, going forward just inside his own half. Zabrowski goes forward, and he's going and he's running at them. He's going, Washington's in the centre. Cross comes in. Oh, it's hooked on the turn there by Connor Washington. Manages to get the ball forward, but he loses it. And the ball is a great pass played by Naylor. He finds Connor Washington on the edge of the area. He goes into the box. He takes it round one player. He crosses it in. Oh, it's cleared. And it was Chapman who was arriving at the far post. Well outside his area, plays it right footed. Forward it goes. Hughes rises for it. He's not going to get this. And uh, Southend are going to get it, but it's blocked. Well blocked by a, a combination of Hughes there and Naylor, but the referees have judged that to be a foul. And this is dangerous because this is about 21 yards out. Pidgeley's on his toes. Two players standing over it. It's Coker, and it's in, and it's in. It's a wonderful free kick, it has to be said. Coker has put it in. He has beaten... Pitchley there, he had no chance Pitchley, he went the right way for it but he was grasping air As uh, referee, not happy with the uh, pushing in the six yard box but uh, steps back to the edge of the area, blows the whistle, Wilmot puts the kick into the far post Minchel heads it back again, comes off the post and Andrew Hughes has got the second goal in added time in the first half for Newport County and once again, the danger man is Robbie Wilmot with his ball. And Lee Minchell at the far post heading it back. Andrew Hughes with a header down onto the keeper's right hand post and into the back of the net. Newport County back in front. Two goals to one, they lead at Rodney Parade. And it's been those balls of Robbie Wilmot involved in both of the goals. And uh, Southend United kick off, attacking the goal to our left-hand side. Minchel positioning himself towards the near post, and it goes towards Minchel. It comes off Yakubu, in fact, and then Coker has to clear it away. Up goes Naylor, gets the header down to Chapman. Chapman back again to Jackson. Jackson heads towards the byline, gets the cross into the far post. Yakubu is there, but he can't make it. It's picked up though by Washington, played back in again, and there it is! What a great goal! Ismail Yakubu! And County with two headed goals this afternoon. And it was Yakubu who stayed upfield, but it was Ryan Jackson's deep cross which had caused all problems. Washington picked it up, played it back in again, and Ismail Yakubu. Gets the third goal for Newport County this afternoon. 
And on the edge of the box, Coker steps over, but uh, robbed by Jackson and then played away by Chapman. And Washington goes on in the chase. Prosser goes with him. Into the area goes Washington. Still Washington. Shoots! And it's that! Oh, my goodness, Tim. Back off the inside of the post. Cool, but only uh, finds Ryan Jackson, who gets robbed. And then Minchel again plays a lovely ball over the top. To guess who? Washington. On the uh, Into the penalty area he goes. Plays it back again to Zabrowski on the edge. Zabrowski looks up. Shoots! And Bentley makes an excellent save. Great save by Bentley, but it's going to be a corner for Newport County. And uh, Southend about to make their third substitution. And uh, Woodrow will be replaced. And uh, the player who's going to be coming on is uh, former county player Craig Reed. In comes the corner from Jones. Deep. And Naylor comes in and it's cleared off the line by Timlin. And County really, the last five minutes, really almost put this game to bed. They've been magnificent. Jackson is going clear on goal. It's three against two. It's Jackson and he's put it wide of goal. It should have been four. But my goodness me, they are cutting Southend United apart. Timlin throws it in, gets the return ball, steadies himself, chips the ball. Forward it goes. The keeper comes and the keeper beats Pitchley, beats Craig Reed to it. A flying save from Pitchley. Then it's Wilmot. Wilmot plays it forward to Washington. Washington holds it and does well and finds Wilmot. Wilmot going forward. It's Wilmot shoots and it's a great save from the keeper again. Jack Payne is beaten to it by Robbie Wilmot and Wilmot plays it through and he's onside and Naylor is screaming, screaming for it to the far post. But it's Connor Washington. Connor Washington takes it into the shoots. Oh, it's gone for a goal kick. But again, plenty of great movement up front for County to take you through to full time because I'm going to have to announce the added time. Charlie. Thank you, Tim. But it's played in the direction of Craig Reedy. Turns. We can't get a boot on it. And for the visual, Gibbs gets the ball ready as Jackson takes the throw in. Headed away by Prosser. Chapman heads it back. And it'll be three minutes as uh, Connor Washington has the ball deep in the half. Flicks it back to Jackson on the edge of the area. To Chapman, lovely flick from him, picking up crew. Oh, and then comes in the shot from Chapman. Tipped over the top by Bentley. If the referee takes another look at his wristwatch. He will blow surely in a minute. Ball is picked up in midfield. There's the referee's whistle. It's three points for County. They've won by three goals to one. It's back to you in the studio.